And this is it. The majority of fans are inside the stadium now, and the tension is palpable here ahead of the UEFA Europa League final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me in the commentary position is, of course, Stuart Robson. And we're just moments away from kickoff. It's Manchester United versus Barcelona. Well, Derek, this has everything, doesn't it? Two good teams, some top-class players, and a couple of excellent coaches. What a final this should be. the team Manchester United will go with David De Gea between the posts Casemiro plays alongside Christian Eriksen in the centre of midfield and the focal point in attack today Marcus Rashford well this is what we think for Barcelona well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come infield to support the centre forward. If they can do that, they're a potent front three. No doubt about that. It is the Europa League final and they are underway. Promising move from Barcelona. Depay. Patient enough build up. Can they carve out a chance? A poor cross, all things considered. Good visualization and execution. Significant block from PK. Rafinha. Pedri. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Marcus Rashford. Oh, nice ball. I must say, this looks promising. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Sergio Roberto. Lewandowski. Pedri. Depay. How can he take them on and beat them? And up for grabs off the keeper. Well, you have to marvel at the technique but no end result for him. Well, he did almost everything right there. Good skill, great contact, but not quite the accuracy. Jaden Sancho. Christian Eriksen now. Bruno Fernandes. Eriksen. 
Rashford. Now Casemiro. Sancho. On to Bruno Fernandes. And a strong tackle. Excellent ball over the top. They'd really have to switch on the turbo to get to that pass. An encouraging move from Barca. Can they forge ahead? They had to react and did. Well worth, I think, at this stage, going back to the chance from earlier. Well, United had the ball, but not anymore. Sergio Roberto. Jordi Alba. Moving the ball effectively, looking for the right moment. Pedri could cross it in here. Diogo Dallo. Rafael Varan. Now Casemiro. Lisandro Martinez. Now with Rashford. Bruno Fernandes. Casemiro and back with Bruno Fernandes well it was straight at the keeper but technically good goalkeeping and he was in the right place to intercept well the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks we're at the end of 45 minutes in this game The quest for Europa League success. And the second half of this final is underway. Ericsson. Now Casemiro. Jaden Sancho. And here is Malassia. Bruno Fernandes. Casemiro. Well, to win the ball back, a chopping challenge, and the referee has got to have a big think about it. Well, deemed to have been a cautionable offence. Well, no question about it. He deserved his book in there. Got to keep the ball a bit better than that. And Barcelona have possession again. Lewandowski, goal for Barcelona! They take the lead in the final. Are they on the way to lifting the trophy? Well, I think everybody knew what was coming, but he hid it so well, didn't he? Nobody could do anything about it. That's a good goal. So back in action, and it's up to United now to be inventive. Nicely timed tackle. Lewandowski.
Well, pass after pass, maybe they can chisel an opportunity. He's protecting it well. And Lewandowski in the thick of things. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Marcus Rashford. Jaden Sancho. Now with Rashford. Encouraging stuff from United. Bruno Fernandes. And options in the centre. And unable to keep the ball. And breaking at pace with Menace. Well, they seem to be onto something positive, but it faded away. Playing advantage here. United keep it. And the cross didn't beat the first man. And that's great work to keep it in play. Rafinha. Lewandowski. Great opportunity. And a goalkeeper in great form. And he's just pulled off an absolutely stunning save there. That is brilliant. Well, the referee was of a mind to see whether anything would come of that, but now he's going to hand out the caution. And he was never going to get away with that one. It's really good refereeing. Here's a change for Manchester United. Let's see about the delivery. Well, as a defender, that will sit you down to the ground. Bruno Fernandes. Just 10 minutes to go. They've got to be really mindful of the time situation, attacking though they might be. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Lovely ball over the top. Well, that was a fairly easy finish in the end, but he still had to take it. He won't mind how they come, though. Well, a second goal for them here. Five minutes to go. Bruno Fernandes. Sancho now. Diogo Dallo. Bruno Fernandes has it. Eriksen. Sancho. Not totaling up all the stoppages. We'll have two additional minutes. Now far from a smooth challenge. Now will the referee produce a card? And he does produce the yellow card. Yeah, and it certainly deserved a yellow. It's a poor challenge, you have to say. Coming off the pitch, number 32, Christian Eriksen, to be replaced by number 30, Gonny van der Beek. Well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. And there's the whistle. This UEFA Europa League final has been decided. And my goodness, they deserve it. Disappointment on one side, but sheer jubilation on the other. Well, relief and joy, I would say. What a great achievement this is, and so well deserved, as you mentioned. They were excellent tonight. What a good performance that was. The party can certainly start now. That's a party to last throughout the year, I should think. They're very happy to be celebrating good times in the Europa League. And now the trophy awaits them.
Well, these are always great moments for any player. This is the culmination of a great tournament they've had. They've